A24 released the first trailer for The Iron Claw starring Zac Efron and Jeremy Allen White. I'm going to take a look at this first trailer next. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's the Outlaw John Roca here, excited to be diving into this first trailer for The Iron Claw, this one from director Sean Durkin, who did Martha Marcy May Marlene, the one that starred Elizabeth Olsen, kind of broke her out as a star. And this one stars Zac Efron and Jeremy Allen White, and a host of other fantastic actors like Holt McElhaney, Maura Tierney, uh, Lily James, all being a part of this film to tell the story of the Von Erichs. And if you're any kind of pro wrestling fan, you guys know I'm a huge pro wrestling fan. Got my Macho Man shirt on here. You know about the successful yet tragic legacy of the Von Erich family and what happened to them with five of the six sons dying by the age of 33, three of them by suicide. So there's a legacy here of abuse, of mental health issues, of uh, pill addiction, drug addiction, alcohol addiction, and a domineering father. So there's a lot of that in the story here with the Von Eric. So A24 seems like the right place to kind of tell this story. So I wonder how much of that darker aspects of the story are going to be part of the trailer, or are they just going to focus on all the championships and the success they had in Texas and other places uh, around the world, uh, including the uh, the old WWF, as it used to be called there with the Texas Tornado, Gary Von Eric. So we will take a look at this trailer here uh, right now, the first one from A24 and director Sean Durkin, and see both uh, how everybody does and also... How they look, because uh, Zach Efron and Jeremy Allen White were certainly hitting the weight. So uh, let's take a look at this first trailer here from A24 right now. Ever since I was a child, people said my family was cursed. Huh. Mom tried to protect us with God. Pop tried Jesus. to protect us with wrestling. He's so he big. said if we were the toughest, the strongest, nothing could ever hurt us. <laughs> yeah. I believed him. We all did. Morning. Pants tomorrow, please, David. <laughs> Perry, I want you to join your brothers in the ring. Yes, sir. I love that. Woo! Now, we all know Carrie's my favorite, then Kev, then David, then Mike. Wow. But the rankings can always change. What do you want in life, Kevin Von Eric? Oh, uh, Lily. More ribs. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be with my family. You know, be with my brothers. What do you like to do with your brothers? Oh, oh yeah, the Freebirds, nice. Together, we can do anything. Oh. We're here to to the that was such a great rivalry. Father built with his own two hands, the hands that were passed down to us, the hands that will deliver the iron clock to you. Oh man, I'm already so it. Like we're alive. I love your family, Kevin. Don't we, Uncle? Yes, sir. Oh, man, that makes me so happy. I talked to you about something, Mom. Dad's too tough on us. You gotta say something. Baby, that's what your brothers are for. Feel that? Ah. You feel that? Ah. That's pressure. Yeah. We're pushing too hard. I'm fine, Kev. Seriously, I'm just sick. I'm scared, man. It all matter control. That's a terrible accident. I should have stopped him. I don't need to think about my family. Your job is to wrestle. Live up to that deal, or we are through. I told you to look out for it! I just love Jesus. being out there with you guys. It's the only thing that matters to me. The Bonner will forever be the greatest family in the history of wrestling. That's Flair. Ooh, man. Um, all right, let's take that down. Wow. Uh, okay. So here's what I say. I thought that was incredible. Uh, as I said in the trailer reaction, I was already in to see the movie a minute into the film. You know, I was, I was a little concerned, Zach Efron. You know, I know the turn has happened and he's doing more dramatic stuff like he did with that Ted Bundy movie, but it doesn't mean I'm necessarily convinced that he can pull off something like this, but... Judging from the trailer, this clearly feels a lot better to me than what was in that Ted Bundy film, which was a bit uneven. This feels like it understands the story it's telling, the tragedy of the story it's telling combined with the success, but the idea of the domineering father. Certainly that is a 
staple in professional wrestling, Stu Hart being one of the most famous with the Stu Hart dungeon there and what he did to people. All the, you watch the uh, documentaries on the Hart family, they all tell you they're eating breakfast, eating lunch, eating dinner, listening to students in the basement of their house screaming for their lives because Stu Hart is pushing them as far as they can go physically with their body on some of the holds. And we see that with Holt McElhinney. By the way, Great choice. I love Holt, obviously, from Mindhunter and a million other things. A guy who is on my bucket list to interview for an hour on the deep cut someday down the road. But I love him as an actor, love him as an energy, any perfect casting for him to play this kind of domineering father. More, more a tyranny here as the mom works really well. Loving the chemistry with uh, Lily James and Zac Efron that we're getting in this trailer as well. Would have loved to see some more Jeremy Allen White because I've become a massive fan of The Bear, uh, The Lady Outlaw, and I tore through the first two seasons great show so would have liked a little bit more here of them but clearly it's going to be focused on Zac Efron and Lily James telling that story through their uh, focus in their prism so I like that but like the way they're capturing that time in pro wrestling and the locations and the areas and the outfits and the look I mean seeing the Freebirds, seeing Ric Flair all of that as a massive uh, fan of the wrestling from back then as I was uh, just makes me so excited. This feels like it's in the right hands. It's got the right vibe, the right atmosphere, and it's going to be willing to go there to tell the tragic story as well as showing the successes and make you feel what happened to this family. Look, this is a family that has a special place in the heart of pro wrestlers. So I think they knew they had to come out with something really good that honored this family and certainly feels that way from this first trailer. What'd y'all think? Did you like it? Did you enjoy it? For those of you who aren't maybe knowledgeable of the Von Erich family, did you get an idea of what we're going to be seeing in here? Did this excite you? Were you into it? Did it look cheesy? Uh, even though that, you know, when they go back in time, when they show the stuff from back then and the outfits they're wearing and in front of those uh, makeshift walls that they put together here, what did you guys think of all of the look of it? Let me know down in the comment section below. What'd you think of seeing the free? Birds, Flair, all that stuff, and of course the Von Erich family. And how did Zach Efron do? How did you feel Zach Efron was doing in the trailer here? Because clearly he opens it with his voiceover and it carries throughout his uh, presence in the trailer. Let me know down in the comments section below. Hit a like on this video, share it on your social media. And you know more than anything else, please subscribe to the channel down below. Hit that subscribe button, hit that bell button so you see we're dropping all the content we do on the Outlaw Nation channel. And head on over to the Patreon, patreon.com slash John Roga. Things are revving back up again on the Patreon. You don't want to miss out. Head on over there. See the perks and benefits that work for you and pick a tier that you like there on the Patreon. All right, this is coming out December 22nd. The Iron Claw put it on your calendar. Kind of odd for a Christmas release, but maybe it'll have a happy, positive ending at the end. I don't know, but we'll see. All right, take care of yourselves. Be well, and I'll talk to you next time with another brand new reaction video here from the Outlaw Nation. Mm -hmm.